Uber passenger has significant brain bruising after fight with driver. This sounds like a full-on frickin' brawl in the car. I love it. Now let's see what happens, right? So Uber driver, so Yao Pinto pointing to his own injury after getting in a fight with a passenger. An Uber passenger who was decked by a driver when he allegedly drunkenly attacked the cabbie suffered significant brain bruising prosecutors charged in court papers. The driver, 30-year-old Soyal Pinto, was cut loose without bail at his Manhattan criminal court arraignment Monday afternoon. A Pinto is charged with assault for the Sunday morning fight that spilled out of his car and onto the street near East 38th Street and 2nd Avenue early Sunday morning, prosecutors said. Wow. The scuffle kicked off when passenger Ahmed Rahat and his girlfriend were in the back seat of the for hire Chevy Suburban and he began punching Pinto. So I need to get this straight. So you're starting to punch the driver. The driver then retaliates and, 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 and Pinto, the, the, the driver, is charged? How does this work? The scuffle kicked off when passenger Ahmad Rahat and his girlfriend were in the backseat of the four hire Chevy and he began punching Pinto. So the first, as far as I know, and I read it right, the first punches were thrown by the passenger, right? Pinto pulled over and the fight spilled onto the street. I would have done the same in Midtown, where he allegedly slugged Rahat, causing him to fall back and slam his head on the pavement. Okay, that's just... Bad luck, buddy, because that's just defending yourself. In a criminal complaint against Pinto, prosecutors noted that Rahat is suffering from significant brain bruising and also has significant con contusions and abrasions to his face. He was also intubated at Bellevue Hospital after the punch out. The arraignment, his defense attorney noted that Pinto has served New York as an Uber driver for five years and was also injured in the fight, requiring stitches to to close a wound. Pinto was due back in court August. What's, WTF, what's going on here? So the passenger attacks this guy and, and this guy takes the fight outside. Okay, knocks him down. The driver ends up getting the charges. I'm confused, folks. Huge shout out to my sponsor, Curiel. Anything delivered, check them out, download the app. What do you think? I mean... Is this right or wrong? And um, I'm glad that the driver stood up for himself. Good job, buddy.